Hello everyone, welcome back to Dark Souls Prepare to Dylon Edition. I am your Dylon for this evening. Today, we are donning the mantle of... Uh, I wanted to go for kind of like a common knight that uh, took matters into his own hands when it came to the forgery. Still got the bow on for some reason. Still still the same, same dude, just uh, <laughs> decided, you know what? I'm sick of letting blacksmiths do get have all the fun, do all the work. So I I have the, uh, I believe the giant, yeah, blacksmith giant hammer. This is the one that has the lightning damage as well, which I think will be pretty useful against most enemies. It's probably one of the toughest uh, or, or strongest hammers we have for a, a lightweight one at, at least. Uh, but real quick, I just wanted to come back just to show off the fact that Rhea is now gone. We've exhausted her dialogue. We exhausted her inventory. And now she's exhausted and she's taking a nap right here. Actually, I never really got a good look at this corpse. I think it's just a normal kind of hollowed out corpse, but it is also, I don't know if I ever talked about this. It's also a female corpse. You can see kind of the the bra strap there, um, and it did have a Firekeeper soul on it in the vanilla game. So some people like to speculate that, oh, maybe it was a Firekeeper. She, they sacrificed her in some kind of weird way. Um, but yeah, just a little bit of, a little bit of speculation start off the video uh but it is 6 39 p.m eastern standard time i don't know why i feel like i need to say that but today we are cleaning up some um some fangs in the duke's archives we are going to go over and fight um or we're going to try our best now that i have a good magic shield bam block um we're gonna go try to fight big hat logan because if you guys remember quite a few episodes ago he went crazy i think it was like four episode 40 something uh, he went crazy. Uh, he went absolutely mad bonkers. What a mad lad uh, from all the knowledge in the Duke's archives. Um, just like Seath did, or, or so it's said. Um, so... Eh. Uh, sorry, but when we tried to fight him... Oh, boy. When we tried to fight him last time, uh, he destroyed us because we didn't have very good magic defense, and he had really strong spells. So we don't want that to happen anymore. Oh god, I forgot about all the large Titanite that drops here. Okay. I love the effect as well when these guys get electrified. It's very beautiful. I don't know if that's every enemy or if it's just the crystalline enemies or it's because of a special attack of opportunity that I'm getting on them. Oh boy, oh boy. Eh. Let's see if I can get a backstab on him. There we go. Beautiful. Hello, sir. I will be healing now. God, this place is like the stuff of nightmares, honestly. Oh! They do so much fucking damage. I know these guys are buffed, too, so it kind of makes sense. I just hate them so much. And they're all probably dropping shit I can't even pick up. But I want it! And I want it now! So I don't actually have to fight that golem. I kind of just want to run past these guys, but, you know, that's always my downfall. I'll take the safe route. And if you're coming through here for the first time or if you're following along, what have you, uh, hopefully you've watched the other episodes. Uh, but going back here, to me, I always feel like is the safest route. Hopefully not getting shot from behind there. All right. Two smacks were done. Now there's a couple archers above us. Part of me wants to just kind of bait this channeler here. Oh, of course. Okay, we did it. We did it. We're good. Now, what did he drop? An entire, an entire, an entire chain set. That's kind of dope. Die. Die. Now we still never got that Avalon bow, and I'm still too scared to do it. <laughs> I'll come through here one of these days. Maybe that's how we will end the episode. If I can manage to fucking fight these guys in the first place. Oh, hello. I didn't even fucking see you there. I don't want my glasses on, so everything in here is just a mess of crystals. Okay, there's that way. Oh, we can just go straight there. Yum. Oh, I thought that's where... Oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> I get confused easily. Leave me alone. And since we're bored... Hello, sir. Die now. So, uh, 
one thing I kind of don't like about the blacksmith hammer, the, the blacksmith giant hammer that we have here, oh boy, is that the, it doesn't have an, a traditional R2 attack. It's R2 is essentially a forward R2. So this is me just pressing the R2 button without any other input on the control stick. Uh, that is usually, like if I use the great club here, you see it has an actual R2 slam, but if I do forward R2, it does that hop. It's not that I hate it. Like I don't, I don't dislike this weapon just because of that, but it definitely makes it less appealing. A, a less versatile move set to me is never uh, is never exciting. All right, so before we go all the way through, we're going to pop a replenishment. I just kind of I want to get a little closer just so we make the most use out of it. And now we should be able to block everything. Oh, I don't have great magic barrier. I should I should have popped that before I came through here, but whatever. We'll give it a shot. We'll give it a shot without it. Hello. Okay. <laughs> I'll take that. A one hit kill, really? <laughs> and I had so much trouble with it before. Ugh. Okay. Well. Eastern Gauntlets. Yay! They're probably one of the nicest looking gloves, I'll be honest. No, 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 no. I kind of just want to show it off. Wait, do I have two sets of the Elite Knight Gauntlets? No, I don't. They look the same here, but I'm pretty sure they are different. Elite Knight set comes from Astora as well. I don't know if I've ever mentioned that. Okay, Eastern Gauntlets. Distinctive gauntlets made in an Eastern land. Exquisitely crafted, these gauntlets offer excellent defense, particular versus slashing attacks, blah, blah, blah. Main threats to the East. Uh, and I'm pretty sure I've gotten all the items from up there as well, because I, I believe it, the first time I came through here, um, there was no... Uh, What's-his-face wasn't even here. Big Hat Logan wasn't even here. He just... Um, he appeared after I beat Seath, I want to say. Maybe even a little after that. Um, but okay. This is good. Just because it was fast doesn't mean it's a bad thing. But I guess it's because he didn't have any armor on. That's why he was so easy to kill. I, uh, again, I... I don't know why I had so much trouble with that originally. I guess I just couldn't get to him. Maybe that's it. But whatever. Hey, we're back. Okay, so now we're going to run through this place just like normal. Maybe just for fun, I'll even stop and try to get the Avalon. Or what is normally in that chest there. It's so tough and I'm not good at this. Maybe I'll rest at... Uh... Die, please. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Maybe I'll rest at the, the next bonfire. Bam. Uh, and just try to do a uh, a bunch of attempts in a row. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you guys. <laughs> ah. Bam. Bam. I still love that sparkle effect. It's so pretty. Now, I am very curious to know if that's just an effect of these crystal. Is he doing that that pose? Oh, he's doing the pose. He's doing the paint me as one of your French girls pose. I love it. That bastard over there. I don't know why I keep trying. I know what I'm going to get, but I always keep trying. All right. We're going to clear this out nice and slow. Do they get less health? Oh, they're not buffed anymore. So maybe they don't have as much health. That could be it. I'm getting shot from somewhere. Oh, up there. Alrighty, alrighty. God, this place is literally like in my nightmares. I know I mentioned that already, but like, ugh. I remember getting so frustrated here. Pretty sparkle. Oh. I want to kill you. There we go. Get those homing arrows out of here. Chain armor. I'm only here for the useful shit, you know? Okay, I gotta go all the way around. <laughs> stop it, stop it, stop it. Please. Okay. And that's it. Bam. There it is. I really want to try, but I know I know for a fact that I'm going to die. 
I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna give it the one. Okay. Oh my god, it just looks so tough. Like, I, I don't think I could do it, honestly. Oh, it goes all the way around. No chance there. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. You guys ready to watch me die? Actually, you know what? I'm going to come back after I do the other thing. And then I'll try to grab it. Because then if I die, I have no shame. <laughs> hey, how did you know I was here? I thought I was... uh. Eh. I thought I was hidden in the shadows. All right. Oh, that bastard. Kill this archer, go over and get him. Eh. Eh. Leave me alone. Ouch. Double whammy. Gazoon tight. Chain leggings. I really hate that he drops those. I'll be honest with you. Okay. This way? It looks bright and vivid. I want to say that's right, even though it's probably wrong. Yeah, where the hell am I going? Die. Die. Oh, yeah. That's in a totally other way, I believe. I'll clear him out just for fun. <coughs> Oh, hey, there's the uh, Crystal Garden. Or what have you. Oh, okay. This is this is actually where I wanted to go. Okay, so the Snake Men, I believe... Yeah, they respawn here. But there is... Oh, and there's some items in here, too. I guess we could take the time. Try to get them. Hello. Eh. Eh, eh. I'm glad you guys are so squishy. Okay. Bop. Now, like I said earlier, or alluded to at least, there is a special prisoner in here. Lady Rhea has actually been captured and transported over here. You can see she's a targetable enemy. She doesn't see us right now. She is hollow, unfortunately, so we do have to kill her. I'll make it quick, I promise. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. I wonder if she has, has the stats from the armor that she's wearing, but that makes some, some NPCs very difficult. She's got a purging stone. Gold tracer. Ooh. That is a sick sword. That's actually from Lord Blade, Kirin, Syrian, whatever her name is. That's the coolest of the two. Um, but that kind of completes our gold set, so if I ever go back to the... Uh, the paladin armor and all that. I might just have to throw that sword on if I can fucking find it. That's the important thing. And where you at? So normally she just drops her talisman, I believe. Where is it? Did I not accept it? Am I crazy? Did I skip it? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, there it is, gold tracer. Oh my god. I was pooping my pants, but it's got a bleed effect of 300, so I believe that's 3 or 30% bleed. Like your damage total, 30% uh, of it is bleed. No. I don't know. I'm pretty dumb, so I'm not sure. E scaling in strength, A scaling in dex, which we do need more dex to make uh, better use of this. Actually, we need at least 25 to be able to use it in the first place, so. Uh, but a curved sword, so this isn't a dagger, this is a full curved sword. Used by the Lord Blade Syrian. Siren, Siaran, Kiaran, one of Lord Gwyn's four knights. Kiaran brandishes her sword in a mesmerizing dance, etches, etching of, Jesus, etching the darkness with dire streaks of gold. It's a very cool looking sword, and she also has a silver tracer. I believe that's what it's called as well, which is a dagger, and I think that does less damage. Less damage? Yeah, it does less damage, and I don't think it does bleed. It does poison. I want to say. Uh, regardless, we want to try to dro drop down and grab that item. I don't think I've ever done it before. Uh, but I'm going to try my darndest here to be able to do it. So I just got to get my bearings. 
Oh, there's a actually a door there too. And I think those are hollow crystallized hollow somethings in there too. Um now I know you can okay, there you go. There's the rafters. But you can't fall in there. That's the thing. So there must be some kind of some kind of zhuzh to fall down to to get to that. So it leads No, it stops right there. As far as I can see. Huh. With nowhere else to go, our heroes turn to the Wikipedia. No. Um, hmm. Is most of this episode going to be me just looking around? <laughs> Possibly. Uh, okay. That looks like where the board starts. Uh, let's see here. Is this a breakable wall? <laughs> I was thinking maybe we could get through. Drop down from there. This might have to be a Google, you guys. I don't want to spend all my time just looking around here. Uh, oh, there's a door in from there. Okay, I can see if I can figure that out. Maybe in this way. Hello. Okay, so there's wh where that door is. Maybe they're one of the keys I have lead to that. Oh, look at that. Triple whammy. Oh, okay, there you go, there you go. I thought it would be simpler than I was making it out to be. Okay, is this the only item? I believe that's the only item. So we will drop down. Is it just a drop? I want to say it's just a drop. Oh, God. Heal. Maybe a little bit to explore here. I guess we'll find out. Isolith Catalyst. I think that's one of the longest catalysts in the game. Just sheer volume. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. I wonder if you can make that jump from here to there. And just turn off the... Uh, the sound right away. Oh, no, it's there. That's where the sound thing is. That's just the bottom tier. Uh, Anywhere to go here? Okay, yeah. Yeah, you can totally make that drop. I've never tried it before, but... Interesting. I love alternate paths. Ah, oh, this game is so good. Crazy that I, I've played through this so many times and I've never had the chance to go this way. Or I've never explored enough to know that I could go this way. God, I find that so fascinating. Whoop. Hello there. I don't want to die from behind. Oh, God. I almost died from the front because I wasn't paying attention. I thought I killed him. Yeet. Wham. One hit. One hit. That's all it takes. I think that was at Acid Breath as well. Are there more... Uh Swiggly beasts down there? Yes, there are. No more items for us, but... I wonder, can I reactivate this? I totally can. I will not be doing that, but maybe if you just want to clear that place out down there. Uh, okay, I guess that is it for this area. I'm going to homeward see where it takes me, and then I'll kind of plan my next move from there. This might just be a compilation of me trying to land that jump. Okay, it brings me all the way back here. Oh, boy. Okay. So I'm going to attune the fall spell. I don't need lightning spear right now. Da -da -da, da -da -da, da -da 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 da 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 All right, fall control. <sighs> and we're going to see if we can't make that jump. I'm very scared. I'm not going to lie. But I'm going to try it. I did have to sit at that bonfire, so I'm going to have to clear out this room again. But maybe I'll cut it out. I don't know. Depends on how many attempts it takes. Hmm. Oh, shit. Another guardian tail. Jesus Christ, that's three now. Could have used that for the Scorpion King build. I could have had one in each hand and uh, one on the butt. And cleric leggings. Those are some thick boy pants. I can't believe I never grabbed that. Just a chest just laying there? That's craziness.
Okay. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. We are back. I'm going to use fall control because I feel like I'm going to die. Um, I looked up <laughs> the way to get this. Uh, and apparently there is an easy way. You um, you have to come down here to to the uh, the spinning thing, the spinning staircase, the Harry Potter shit. Spin it around. Uh, stand here, I believe, just to map this as like the last point that you've like the solid ground that you've stood on. Go back up, spin it, quit out, load back up. You can find a guide on it online. Uh, and then you're just right here. So let's see if I uh, die here. It's very likely. Jesus Christ. Oh my God, I'm okay. And here it is. Let's see if it was worth all the headache and hassle. Anklet of the Great Lord and a Crystal Knight shield. You better fucking believe we're putting this on. Oh, we also got the cleric leggings. Leggings worn by the warrior clerics of the Way of White who are famous for being unyielding in battle. They are rather substantial in size and weight, making its wearer look even bigger than he actually is. So that's what those look like. Fucking Jenko jeans. And then we've got... Great Lord. Come on. Anklet of the Great Lord. And his wash, his washcloths. His waist cloths and all. Anklets of Gwyn, Lord of Cinder, who linked the first flame. Uh, and this is all of the stuff that's on all of his equipment. But okay, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode. Oh god, I'm so tired from all that walking around. All those attempts. My poor souls. Uh, next episode, we will since we cleaned up the uh, Duke's archives and all, uh, we will be going back to the downstairs, back to hell. And I can't wait to see you. Uh, fucking Christ, I can't wait to see all you guys there. I can't speak English. It's been a long day. <laughs> I'll do the wave. Why not? I'll do the wave. Bye-bye.